Alright guys, I'm back for another video and welcome to Hypixel Skyblock Silo! And we're back! It's been freaking forever. I know for the people watching the videos, this probably doesn't feel like too big a time jump, but man, for the people watching the streams, it has been 10 days since I've done a stream. That paired with uploading every other day, this channel must have been freaking dead. It's not dead. Oh, apparently they fixed the whole speed thing with farming hose. So that's unfortunate. Let me see something. So I have 362% speed. And then if I were to go into the inventory here, no, they did fix it. And if I put it in my hand, it'll probably give me the speed, right? Ah, well, rip. They, they, they fixed the thing. So you can't stack speed anymore with um, farming hose. Not even one. I was hoping you can at least have one, but nope, you can't have any. So that's rip. Also, I've been putting up kiwis. Uh, those didn't really get too men too much, but we are now at um, 790 million because uh, we've been going kind of crazy with. Well, you guys have been going kind of crazy with contraband, uh, as you guys know. Lemon is a uh, lemon. So uh, I know the title and thumbnail is not about this, but I want to do this because <laughs> these guys have been sitting here for 14 days and with hyper catalysts that is four times drops for 14 days which is essentially 48 days of the minions so a month and a half of max minion setup because the uh the fly catchers basically replaced the plasma bucket not quite but pretty much i think safe estimate over a month's worth of drops from these minions today we're gonna collect them and we're gonna see how much fishing XP I get. So before we do that, let's go into our pet menu here. Oh, and real quick, before we do that, look what we got. I maxed out social skill. Let's go. Social 25, number 76 out of the network. That makes two cosmetic skills that I have maxed. Carpentry is not 50 yet, but we might be able to change that today. I don't know. Anyways, here goes. boom and there we go we ended it off with over a stack of enchanted cooked fish by the way which is just ridiculous and the ammonites level 94 almost 95 now and the megalodons level 87 just from xp share that is impressive all right now here's what we're gonna do we're gonna set up a sell offer for these 33 million worth of that alone uh, enchanted cooked salmon worth about 7.7 .7, and then if we were to insta sell the rest <laughs> boom just a casual like 70 something million from fishing minions now i'm pretty sure that's still not enough to cover the catalyst cost so we are losing money from this but the amount of xp we just got is insanity there we go it it literally just bugged out and shows it shows literally nothing and there you have it we are not we are now carpentry l that's kind of crazy though carpentry 50 rune crafting 25 social 25 which is very rare taming 50 alchemy 50 enchanting 60 mining 60 farming 60 and then we have combat at 59. So if we run enough Duggins, then we get it to 60. And then we have forging and fishing. And um, forging, I have a feeling, will be fairly easy to get to 60 once we actually, like, you know, uh, once, we, once we get that update. So you guys might remember the warped aspect of the end, or the, the void. The void. The AOTE is one of those weapons that has just been, like, a part of this game ever since not quite the beginning but the first big update and it's probably the most beloved weapon in this game simply for its teleport ability it starts out with a clean one 50 mana per teleport and it just it just puts you forward but then as time went on what was the first upgrade they made i think it was warped the warped reforge was the first upgrade they made to aote it was with floor four and dungeons i believe 
and what warped did is it would basically just give you a massive boost to your strength and crit damage oh and there is strong dragon armor which was technically the first upgrade right gives you some strength on the weapon but after they did that we went a little while with no updates uh ultimate wise did come with dungeons actually so warped was technically this third upgrade but yeah ultimate wise 5 halved it to 25 instead of uh 50. oh it's floor 5 not floor 4 for warp stone and then we went like almost a year with no update to the weapon but then we got aspect of the void with the enderman slayer update which reduces it to 23 mana <laughs> oh boy so we saved two per right click uh what else did they do they also in that same up they added transmission tuners which add two blocks of range each and you get to add two of them so four more blocks of range on teleport and then most recently with the crystal hollows they added gemstones and power scrolls now off camera i added if we go to the recipe book mining go all the way to the last page i added one of these a sapphire power scroll gain plus five mana when using your right click item ability so what this basically does is it effectively reduces the cost of the right click ability so it says minus 23 but you might notice if you were to look here it says 516 then it goes down it only costs 18 mana instead of 25 and that's because the power scroll gives plus five mana every time you right click which is really nice AOTE on the floor. I also put a perfect Sapphire Gemstone, which gives extra intelligence. So it doesn't make the ability any better, but you know, it, it's a thing. And of course, um, yeah, so we have a perfect Gemstone on there. We have the Power Crystal in there. It's warped. I even put a Fuming Hot Potato Books and an Art of War on this thing. And you could tell the scroll is on it because of the uh, the little symbol by the instant transmission there. And we've also got almost all max enchantments on this guy. But as of a few streams ago, we also got the next part of this equation. And that is the Ice Wise armor set. Look at this beautiful, exotic, wise dragon armor doesn't usually look like a breath mint wise dragon armor reduces abilities to two-thirds of their normal cost so now instead of 23 it costs 15 but since we have the power scroll we're actually only spending 10 mana to teleport there's one more thing i can do here and that's equip the sheep pit which reduces the ability cost by another 20 percent. so now we are at minus 12 mana it says but what we're actually doing why is it not <laughs> literally gaining mana faster than but anyways it takes about seven mana i've calculated seven mana per right click to use an aote we pretty much can teleport for free so the consequence of that is that if we were to go down here and just hold right click we we are literally like we are losing mana at like 10 per second while teleporting constantly like I have to literally, I'm pretty sure it's impossible to actually use up all the mana while still teleporting somewhere meaningful. Because if I go too far in one direction, then I just get teleported back to the map. Like, <laughs> you genuinely can't use the mana up fast enough. And yes, I know Shadow Assassin boots reduce it as well by 10. But you know what, chat? That doesn't matter. Because the, <laughs> it might be like one or two mana better. But you can't argue with the winter green ice <laughs> ice wise yeah so this is the only way to expend all of the mana is the butterfly click and <laughs> ah! so in honor of that ridiculous realization that i just made seven mana per teleport i think it's time to max this guy out and i mean for real so like we're gonna do all the stupid today you guys ready we're gonna do the stupid and max out the aote completely All right, next. Do we have enough levels to actually apply it? 500 levels? I don't think I've ever bought one of these before, but I think now is the perfect time. Colossal XP bottle. Is that even enough? It is. Oh boy. The only thing that it says is, okay, am I missing anything in terms of enchantments? 
I said other than execute chat. Telekinesis 2. Ah, yes. Unfortunately, I'm only <laughs> Void Gloom 6. So we can't put the Ether Warp on. Well, maybe we can, but it wouldn't work. I don't really know how the specifics work. Here it is. There we go. Ether Warp Conduit. We can buy one. I don't know if it... I want to at least apply it. I don't know if it's going to let me. So we need to find someone to put this on the AOTE and then it's maxed. I mean, look at this thing. Hot potato books, fuming potato books, art of war, warped, recombed, ultimate wise five, every max enchantment you could freaking think of. It has the power scroll. It has the gem. It has two, um, two transmission tuners on it. Is there anything else I missed? I think that's everything. Oh. Oh, that's how it's done. So then I do this. It's not an anvil. Oh, I see. Oh, wait. Wait, <laughs> wait a minute. <laughs> Chat, <laughs> I didn't need to get someone to do it. Um, it just worked. Sneak right click. Wait, you're telling me it just... <laughs> Yeah, chat. Um, <laughs> well, there you go. It's max now. That's it. That's the best aspect of the end in the game. Definitively the best. You can't get any better than this. Sure, you can get more expensive. Chimera 5. But it's ultimately pointless because you're supposed to use it to teleport. 48 mana, by the way, to use Ether Warp. That's not bad. It just worked without... Now, here's the thing. As soon as they patch that, I can't use my AOTE. So I need to get Enderman 7 as soon as possible because it's going to get patched at some point. Just like the Terminators where everybody's like, oh no, I can't use my 1 billion coin bow if I don't spend three hours killing Enderman. So now it's worth 200 mil less apparently. Let's give it the best chance possible, which means... Oh, by the way, look what I got off camera. with an aote oh hold on we're not <laughs> let's cut that by accident we need uh this 400,000 damage with an aote is kind of impressive 400,000 damage to how is that huh pretty good i'd say and now i can do this <laughs> whoa oh that's neat oh you can teleport so far away and only oh now it says 90 mana oh it's because i'm using uh not wise armor that's right but even with my damaging set it only costs like less than 10 percent my mana like bruh and you know what now we have the best aot in the game that yeah i'm very happy with that i mean it's always been my favorite weapon in skyblock if you were to ask me like six months ago a year ago 18 months ago my answer would always be the aot is the best weapon in this game not because of like the damage but just it's so useful Oh, does either warp still? Never mind, they patched it. I was about to say, can you use it in trap room and dungeons? I don't think you can. That is very satisfying. And then, of course, you know, the final piece of the puzzle. I mean, look at this. The best AOTE and the best Y set. I mean, look at this. Ice wise. I could hypermax the Y set, like the boots here. I just don't see a reason to. But, like, it's a good flex, though. I mean, look at <laughs> the exotics as well okay <laughs> wow <laughs> okay yeah that's powerful that's very powerful oh you know what there is a use i can think of for this hold on if i were to genuinely hold on yeah strong's good because it gives you two more uh teleport range so that makes the ability go 14 blocks which is stupid that was good that was freaking good i think i just did it i think <laughs> that was one of my first attempts and that was really good that was sub eight seconds that was sub eight seconds just there okay my foot fell asleep so hold on chat does anyone know if there's a, a stat for the world record on that i probably did not hit it because that would be way too easy gg